across this whole sailing adventure, it has never been about a goal of circumnavigation to sail around the world. It has been, and it still is, about a life's journey. Good morning. The storm passed. We had a lot of rain, but the sun is shining. It's cold compared to the other days, and there is a little bit of wind. So, we're gonna hoist the sails because we ran out of food. Benjamin is complaining for bananas for days. And uh, I think it's gonna be a beautiful day. Rainbow! A lifestyle based on freedom and that sense of feeling alive every day. To do what we truly desire and to contribute to others. A life of meaning. And for now we have found a home base here in Montenegro, where we will do several projects that fit within our desires. Montenegro, a place where we see so much entrepreneurial opportunities and a great foundation to build upon for the future years to come. This means our beautiful perfect sands won't leave the Bay of Kotor the coming times. She will be open for day charters in high season, until we are ready again to continue our circumnavigation and to find that next spot where we will land for a little while or maybe a bit longer. When we will exactly set sail again to continue the adventure around the world by sea, we do not know and time will tell. What we do know is that we will do shorter trips on the mat, as we really can't see our lives not sailing or our life without sailing. So we entered a new chapter in our life, the hybrid sailing lifestyle just until we become full-time liverboards again. But for now, join us in a beautiful winter sail. Are you ready, Benjamin? Yeah. Ready for sailing the first time? Yeah. Are you ready to sail your little sister? <laughs> so we are ready for the first sail of the year. And the first sail together with, Bobby! with Eleonora. Bob! It's five degrees. Bye, it's bye, hailing. Bye, bye. Uh, there's a little bit of breeze, but we can't just wait to go out and uh, start sailing. Benjamin is ready as well. So here we go. Hello! Game <laughs> over. Good job, Captain. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> yeah, we are in a different spot, so it's just in the case, so there's no much room to maneuver. But uh, yeah, we all did a good job. So exciting. We're going out. Yes. First time. And a fun fact. Um, Eleanor is now at almost the same age as Benjamin was when we first set out the marina in Valencia four years ago. Porto Montenegro, Porto Montenegro, this is setting up your sense over. <laughs> Here we go. Look, they're sailing over there, you see? Uh, to starboard. A little bit more to starboard. The other starboard. Oh! <laughs> Here you go. Watch the big, the big super yacht, Ben. Don't gonna hit it. The insurance is not gonna like it. Come on, go back, go back, go back, go back. You can do it, you can do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. Oh, no, no, too much, too much, too much. Other way, other way, other way. More, more, to the green, to the green. Here we go, here we go. Nice and easy, it's okay. You see? The bow is moving. And now we'll go back. Go back a little bit red. A little bit of red. A little bit of red. And on the side. Yes. Go. Oh, well done, Benjamin. A little bit more. Hey! Mommy, stop! 
It's a buoy, Benjamin. They're racing. Like the ocean race. Back on sailing, fantastic. We are still inside with uh, Leonora, but they will come out for sure. Look at this. It's getting a little bit more light over there. Back feeling the breeze. Ready? First I'm waiting up behind anchor and it's pretty amazing and especially with the heat I'm preparing myself mentally as well to jump in the water so I have my bathing suit on and I'm gonna make some breakfast and then um, we're gonna jump in the cold water and how is super dad doing <laughs> what is it then super dad is doing well do you see the iPad? No, yeah. no, 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 no. No iPads, but you know, only in the Okay, well, welcome to the new stage. <laughs> so, we're going to start the day with a delicious smoothie and some toast of vegan bread. And uh, then uh, we're up for the cold dip. And I asked Benjamin to join because we did a cold dip with, all, uh, with uh, New Year. 
but he hated it, so he said, no, I will take a picture. swim this morning. Definitely. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Yeah. I already vlogged about it and you as well I think. <laughs> but uh so I'm I committed already to the viewers Is the it? camera. Mm. Yeah. So no turning back. No turning back. And how cold is it outside? I think it's 14 degrees the water so that's but maybe it's a little bit colder here because here it comes from the mountains. It is 12 degrees. Okay two degrees less. It's cold. But I just keep saying to myself, just like when I do a cold shower at the end, this is for my health. I know I will get uh, better with every time I'm doing this. So that's a good leverage driver to uh, keep on doing it. I, I just practice cold showers every day, so it shouldn't be a problem, right? She's not even cold. Warm feet. As you know us, we don't back down from a little bit of cold. If it is camping in a rooftop tent with minus 15 Celsius degrees or sailing in winter and windy condition, we just get out there. So let's put Waybuster to the test. And a special thanks to them for making us feel at home even in winter time. Because let's be honest, having a cold boat is really no fun at all. You stay longer in bed, you are more tired, less productive and don't enjoy the boat life that much. But now, with a constant heat of 22 plus degrees Celsius, we feel like it's summer even in winter time. We hope to see you next time. For now, we end with some more sailing and waterfalls. Yes, you read that right. We sail in front of a waterfall. Go on. Go on. Okay, one, two, three. So, how is it inside? Very warm. Warm and cozy, right? Is that a waterfall? Whoa, what is that? It's a waterfall, Benjamin. It's impressive, right? Yeah, keep speed. I'm so in love with this boat. Never I had a re regret about the perfect sense. And I still, every time I look at her, I still fall in love. And every drone shot I make and every shot I make, man, this is all what I imagined of purchasing the, let's say, the perfect boat for me. And still, after almost seven years.
So we finished uh, the heating on board the boat and now we are driving in the mountains with a lot of snow. Yeah, we're going to the property uh, just to see the first snowfall, which is probably amazing. And uh, yeah, we have done a quite a few jobs there as well. So we're looking forward to show you that as well. And that will be uh, in a few minutes. We're actually there. It's so great because in just 30 minutes drive from the bay, you are here and in the bay you can sail and now you have, let's say, what is it, half a meter, almost a meter of snow? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, and now it's, is the road accessible? I don't know, it should be. Wow. <laughs> That's our road. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna manage. <laughs> Benjamin, big time snow. Yeah. How cool is this? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Go! Here you go! So this is fantastic! <laughs> Herman is going to uh, one of our neighbors here in front to ask if we can get to our property another way and uh, in the meanwhile I'm trying to lift up the drone take a look around but it's quite incredibly beautiful the winter landscape here is at the front of the entrance of the road and they say well they don't speak English so it's always <laughs> a question what they actually say but they said uh, we should go straight on to the nearest village Lucy and then take a left a right or a left right. right right and then probably can get to our uh, property and uh, I thought about it just now it's just like doing business, you always have to pivot and change approach. Yeah, yeah, this, is, this, <laughs> this one was definitely not working. No, so, so let's take a different one. Ask the experts. Yes. Yes! So, we tried. And Grac we failed. Graciously failed. <laughs> <laughs> so we can't reach our home over here. It looks like we can't reach. We, there are two other roads we haven't tried yet. Yeah. So but it's getting dark. It's getting cold. So let's go sailing, right? Yes. <laughs> no, but we will, uh, we will figure it out. Indeed. We, we will figure it out. Yeah. And otherwise, uh, we need to call Tova one of our mental program participants in the Norway, Norway 
Yeah, yeah and, she, her, uh, and, and she has a scooter. snow scooter. So, <laughs> Tover, this one is for you. And see you next week. Thank you, man. So we tried one of the two roads and it seems that we're almost there. Yes, so this is uh, they cleaned the road or what you can say Same. clean, but uh, we're almost there. So come on, John. Final piece, final, how many meters? Well, this is... Wait, let me turn on the camera, <laughs> yes. Well, it's still a lot, because it's like, I think it's like 500, 500 meters. meters. Yeah, but let's see. We don't know how to come back, but for now we made it. Well, and here we can turn. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Here we can wait. turn. Yeah. So that's good. Well, here it is. Here, here it is. Again. Wow. This is it. Look at this, guys. And there it is. Okay, Ben. Hello, darling. Hello. You made it. Yeah. You found it scary, right? Yeah. This one's a GoPro uh, mill function. But I had to be honest, I did find it scary. Can I totally relaxed? No, I'm not relaxed, but <gasps> for me it's how to how to get back. Because yeah. we, ha we have to make a turn over here. Yeah, but that's okay, I think. Yeah, I will try that yeah. before it gets really dark. So yeah. I give the camera to you.
pretty mess. Well, let's go then. Come on, go to daddy. Go to daddy. So, let's go. Let's go to the property. Whoa. <laughs> Come on, Ben. Are you me? Yeah. You wanna go with me? Come on. Whoa. Come. Can't be mentioned. Two weeks ago, we were here. The sun was shining. We took off all the tiles of the roof. I had a campfire and now it's completely covered. <laughs> you like it here, Ben? Where's gonna be your tree house? Yeah. Where's the bowmud? Where's the tree house? No, man, what a journey back on board. Nice and warm over here. It was quite an adventure, right? Yeah, very cool. Yeah. And this Just is like in business. Yes, right? indeed. <laughs> indeed. So first we, we got stuck, then we took a different approach. Then we got kind of stuck again. Yeah. And then we kept going and then finally we found the house. And yeah. Now heating up. Heating up. In business. In business, right. right. Oh, man. Uh, I made one deal. One deal in my life, I had to uh, buy out some uh, some investors for a big amount of money and I made a deal and I will never make that deal ever in my life again. But it got hot, hot under my feet, I think, for six months in a row. But uh, I will explain more about it in the podcast. We got a record, right? Yes. Cool. So the link below. Yeah. So that was it. Thank you and watch us for our adventures for next week.